welcome back to my channel so today I'm going to be showing you how to get this look and this is just a really pretty spring inspired makeup tutorial um, I figured this was like simple enough and pretty enough to wear to pretty much any occasion so I feel like this would be cute for a party or graduation or even like prom if you wanted to make it for prom but this eye look is pretty simple to do and I hope my lashes are on right and in this video, I'm using a lot of new products that I got from Milani. Y'all, Milani has amazing matte lipsticks. Like, I got all these matte lipsticks, and I'm going to be showing you guys how this look really translates well with pretty much any lip color. And I will also be showing you guys how I use some new products that I got from Milani that I'm loving. So, if you guys want to see how I got this look, then just keep on watching. Also, you guys can get 50% 15% off of a Milani purchase using the code Milani2015. You can get free shipping on any order over 25 bucks. So, I will have the link and that coupon code in the description box for you guys to check out if you want to try any of the new products cuz these lipsticks are bomb. If you guys would like to know what what I'm wearing on my face. How long has that been back there? If you guys like to know what's on my face, I will have a separate tutorial. Be sure to click the link. It's going to be in the card section that I've talked about before, or you can click the link in the description box. I will have it linked down there so you guys can see what's on my face. I will talk to you guys in my next video, but let's get on to the tutorial. Bye. So first I'm going to use my Milani Brow Shaping Gel, and I'm going to just use this to lay down my brow hairs and make them all go in the right direction. I just got my brows done so they look pretty good but I like to use a brow gel just to make sure that my brows stay in place and I'm going to fill them in with my favorite pencil and this is by Ofra and this is their universal brow pencil. And after that I'm going to use this Bella Eyes eyeshadow by Milani and I love these eyeshadows because they're like a gel powder consistency. So they start as a gel and they transform into a powder eyeshadow and they can be used wet or dry. And I'm going to be using a coppery shade and a lighter champagne shade. I'm putting down the coppery shade first and then I'm going to layer the champagne on top just to give a multi-dimensional metallic look to my eyes. And I'm also going to put that on the lower lash line. And next I'm using this eyeshadow by IT Cosmetics and it's called Sunset. It's like a orangish reddish color and I'm going to use that on the outer corner and the inner corner and in the crease so I'm making kind of like a rainbow type thing on my eye and it kind of just gives like a warmthness to my crease. And then I'm going to take Taupe by Lorac, my Lorac Pro Palette and I'm going to blend that color out and make it a little softer so it's not too harsh and then I'm going to use a brown um, a darker brown color in like the very middle of the crease and the outer corner just to darken it and deepen it just a little bit give a little more depth and then if you feel like you need to go back and add a little more eyeshadow to the center to make the metallic pop a little bit more you can so that's what I'm doing with the champagne color and then I went ahead and did my eyelashes and my rest of my face off camera. But I'm going to be using this bronzer by Milani and this is the color Glow. Their big bronzers are literally life. Like they're the best thing ever because they're so pretty and glowy and they make your face look nice and warm and sun kissed. So I'm putting that bronziness everywhere where the sun would hit my face. And then I'm going to use this rose blush called romantic rose and it's very very pretty and I'm just gonna tap my blush my brush in that and apply it as my blush on my cheeks and I love this color blush because it is very rosy and it looks very natural okay moving on to my lips so I have all these lip colors that I'm gonna try for you guys and the first color that I'm gonna try for you guys is this purple and it is called matte glam it's very pretty the next one is Matte Passion, and it is a very pretty orange color. I love this one. Next one is Blissful, and this one is a bright pink color. It would probably look a lot better with a lip liner and another coat because it went on a little bit patchy on me. This one is Diva, and it is a bubblegum pink color, and this one is really pretty. It reminds me a lot of that MAC lipstick that I can't remember the name of that everybody loves. 
So the next one is Matte Orchid. This one is a deeper berry pink, but it's still very, very bright. And I like this one a lot better than the other one on me. And then the last one I'm going to be trying is Matte Naked. And I love this one. You guys know I love nude lipsticks, though. I'm just obsessed with nude. So this is probably my favorite out of all of them. It's a really great nude color. It reminds me a lot of Velvet Teddy because it matches my skin tone very well. And I'm going to be using it with a lip liner because lip liners just help to keep it from feathering and um, help the lipstick to blend in with your skin tone better if you have darker skin. So I'm using the color BFF3 by ColourPop Cosmetics. And then I'm just going back and adding a little bit more shine to my T-zone area because I want it to look more glowy. And that's it. So I hope that you guys enjoyed this and I will talk to you guys in my next video. Okay? Bye!